after discussing about the anatomy of the postlateral corner now i'm going to discuss about the injuries of the postlateral corner the most common pattern of injury is due to direct blow to the anteromedial tibia in the extended position of the knee that creates the lateral force and that will gap open the lateral side of the knee resulting in injury of the postlateral corner structures other mechanisms may be due to rotatory subluxation or hyperextension a laterally directed force will lead to impaction injuries between the medial femoral and the tibial condyles so it will result in a kissing contusion of the structures and this can be a hint to the presence of first lateral corner injury again you have to look at the three major structures namely the lateral collateral ligament the popliteus myotendinous unit and the popliteal fibular ligament now it is time to see some cases uh, first we will review a sagittal fat set pd image of the knee uh, from the extreme lateral aspect uh, first you get to see the partial tear of the lateral collateral ligament and then you can appreciate the avulsion of the fibular head this is due to avulsion of the bicep femoris tendon subsequent to this you can see the avulsion of the popliteal fibular ligament then the arcuate ligament and posterior capsule injury then the popliteus myotendinous junction injury and don't miss the facial avulsion now we'll see the coronal images from the anterior to posterior there's a big chunk of bone from the anterolateral tibia uh, this is attached to the iliotibial band so this is due to avulsion of the iliotibial band behind this there is a lateral collateral ligament uh, which is wavy and there is tear from the femoral attachment you can appreciate the increased signal in the attachment of the popliteus tendon but tendon is not torn the popliteal fibular ligament is partially torn with increased signal and there is complete avulsion of the biceps femoris tendon from the fibular attachment the same case sagittal images showing there is torn lateral collateral ligament as well as the biceps femoris tendon there is injury to the grade 1 injury to the uh, popliteal fibular ligament and the arcuate ligament postural capsular injury and there is associated injury of the acl complete tear